In an increasingly crowded United Kingdom, it's rush hour for the country's cemeteries. Graveyards are rapidly running out of space and are predicted to be full within the next few decades. So, the authorities have come up with a controversial idea to simply reuse them. Laura Smith reports next then on how even that may not solve the problem. As the saying goes, nothing is certain but death and taxes. And while the UK government's very good at collecting tax, it's not so good at providing for its citizens' inevitable demise. Because on this small island, we're fast running out of space to bury the dead. According to a recent study of borough councils, almost half said burial space in their areas would run out in the next 20 years, and a quarter said they only had 10 years left. And it's not a problem confined to London cemeteries like this one. Several rural councils already say they're full, meaning people will have to go elsewhere for their final resting place. And all that despite the fact that already 74% of people are cremated. Uh, cemeteries are not sustainable. When they're full, uh, a local authority has some difficult decisions to make. Uh, d does it build another cemetery uh, at a higher capital cost? And then, of course, it's got another cemetery to maintain, increased maintenance costs. So there's a pressure to increase fees. An obvious solution would be to open more cemeteries, but the limited amount of space means that's just a holding tactic. You could force people to be cremated, also not workable, which only leaves a very emotive option, reusing graves by digging up any remains and then digging deeper to make space for more burials. And the disturbance of human remains without lawful authority at the moment is an offence. Uh, and the Ministry of Justice uh, won't give a licence to create new burial space, although they'll give a licence to clear a churchyard and perhaps build a supermarket or a car park, which seems uh, a little bit odd. At the moment, reusing graves is only allowed in London cemeteries. And although it's an issue that affects literally everyone, it's not exactly a vote winner, so typically governments just avoid talking about it. But experts say those in power must come up with a workable plan on burials, rather than just burying their own heads in the sand.